So this is the original cigar caddy. It's made by Otterbox, manufactured in the USA. For you, you could use it for uh, traveling. And yeah, obviously, you can use it when you go out hunting, fishing, boating, uh, or just reviving actually cigars. People don't know that, but uh, it's a little trick you can do with these. These are humidifying in addition to uh, providing uh, physical protection. There's a little uh, humidifier in there. I'll show you in a second. But uh, before you walk up and start using these, before you even start talking about the treats inside one of these boxes, uh, you're going to get the attention, you're going to be the life of the party because these boxes on there by themselves have a little story to tell. Um, they are known for being crush proof. This is made of ABS, uh, you know, uh, molded plastic. Uh, they used to advertise that you could run a 4x4 over one of these and your cigars would absolutely be fine. They cannot be crushed. It also can withstand temperatures from minus 10 degrees to 175 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, it's uh, <laughs> it's it, it's supposed to be well it is airtight that's for sure it's also floats uh, on the water and if for some reason it was that submerged this can go down to 100 feet and your cigars would still be fine uh, so from a physical standpoint your cigars are protected but uh, people love to hear about that stuff I mean this is original you don't see too many people walking around with these it's got a, um, a little strap here you put your wrist on it and you can see this is um, a model 2000 it holds five churchill cigars but i'll show you in a second um, what that means it's six and a half inches long all the way through from here to here um, i have decent sized hands but this carries really well now some of the other models uh, from otterbox from pardo like the pardo that's very popular that's 8.8 .8 inches goes all the way out to here and actually i mean it's all about the sticks that you're going to carry but if you don't need it um, a bigger one is actually, you know, the bigger ones look a little bit awkward, whereas this just kind of looks perfect, you know, gripped in your hand like this, carrying it around. And, um, you know, I have it zoomed in, but it's not that big at all. It blends in well. Um, it does hold five Churchill cigars, but the, and, oh, one of the key things about this, I mean, these, I, almost, I need two hands. You can't just open this with one hand, literally. I'm trying now, I can't. A lot of resistance. That's because it's watertight and really good clamps. There you go, you heard that pop. Um, these have really excellent seals here. Another distinguishing fact between these, this model and you know, the Otterbox and some of the cheaper ones, this is where a lot of the uh, other models break down. There's a, a metal rod in here, a hinge. It's plastic on the outside, but that's why that doesn't break. And here's where you got these rubber seals. And this is quite old and it's still in you know, perfect shape. This is polyurethane foam. And uh, this is where some of the other models differ too. So these are cut out. Uh, these are perfect for your Monte Cristo number two, Romeo and Juliet number two, Punch Punch, um, yeah, 42 inch gauge. Now, I've had zero issues putting a, um, a Robusto in here. I got 50 gauge, why? Because they're, you know, they're obviously the circular, and they can still fit within here. It's on a 42 gauge or Monte, Monte Cristo number two. Let's say uh, more of the cigar itself will be buried in there. Now I, I know you're all saying, why don't you show me the cigars? Well, YouTube has very strong um, policies on any tobacco. I cannot show that, but so a 42 would fit, you know, deeper in here. A 50 gauge is going to sit in here too because this is circular. It accommodates it. You can only just put you know maybe one or two um, I've had no issues also you know I could fit you know one or two uh, Monte Cristo or Romeo two. you know anything with a 42 I can put this in there at the same time I can put these you know like that and uh, you know fit one or two here and I'm not you know you don't need this big lighter in there but point is you can put extra stuff in there if you're fitting smaller cigars that works too this is the key part here where um, where you know it humidifies too. Now you only need a few drops of water, and that's part of the key. When I first got it, I put too much water in there. This will not only keep your cigars humid or, or proper, uh, it won't regulate it, but it'll keep them moist for literally weeks. Certainly a week of vacation is not an issue, and that's where you want to make sure that you don't put too much water. You want to use distilled water the same way you do with your humidor at home. Um, but this definitely retains water and, and the whole thing retains moisture. Um, 
it just works perfectly that way. And that's also why you can use it to revive cigars um, that have been dried out. Now, a lot of you probably look at the Pardo. The Pardo is 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 uh, much larger. It's 8.8 inches uh, long. It's 5.2 inches uh, wide, whereas this is only four and a quarter inches wide. And um, this is 1.5 inches thick, whereas the Pardo is 2.1 inches. So it's bigger that way, all the way around. But one of the other big differences is the Pardo is um, has this has you know also has foam and these cutouts. But the foam part on the top is that egg crate type, where it's like those bubbles that kind of stick out. And the issue there is your, your cigars are still protected; they, they won't move around. But over time, depending upon how long you keep your cigars in there, those those little those fo egg foams that come down like this and are going to hit your cigars like this, they're not going to affect the cigars, but over time, those foam things will get compressed and start to flatten out like that, if that makes sense. It's, it's hard to show, but over time, they'll flatten out because you're putting it against that pressure. Um, I much prefer, you know, the cutouts on this side, especially if you can only be using, um, you know, 42 or smaller. Um, so, Scar Caddy Outer Box doesn't make one. This only holds five Churchills. Outerbox makes one that holds 10, that's the uh, 3240 model, um, and obviously that's going to be, they double stack them, is what, how that works out. Um, but overall, this is this is just a great, <laughs> great thing, it, it's it's so perfect, I don't know how to explain it, but you know, you, you could keep this in your, if you want to keep your cigars in your car, this is going to protect them from the cold, from the hot, from the water. Um, you just know you throw this in your in your bag, bag to go to, uh, on vacation, and there's zero worries. And like I said, you know if you're only carrying around a couple of sticks, um, again, look at this airtight. You can definitely fit this in there so you don't lose it. Two cigars in here, or you know a lighter in there. It all works. Anyway, look if you have any questions, uh, leave them in the comments below. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you found this all helpful, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more, subscribe down below. Thank you for joining.